Hello everybody, this is going to be a quick review of the MagMod Starter Flash Kit 2. Uh, this is the second generation version of the uh, light modifier and uh, some additional accessories from MagMod. I've been using this kit for uh, a little bit less than a year, so I can finally give my overall review and thoughts of this um, uh, light diffuser and accessories. So uh, as you can see it comes in this box and uh, in the back you see what you get as part of the kit. So you get the mag grip, the mag sphere and the mag grid. So this is what you put in your speed light and it has magnets to hook up your mag sphere. This is the diffuser and you also get an optional accessory that I honestly haven't used this uh, mag grid yet but it's a, a nice one to have anyways. So this is what you get inside. So like I said before, I already, already used this one several, uh, actually many times in the past. Uh, I just decided to keep the box because uh, it's a nice box. And this is what you get. So you get your, your three items like I mentioned before. You get your Mag Grip 2, the Mag Sphere 2 diffuser, and the Mag Grid. Let me get it out of the, of the bag there. Oh, and you also get this nice, kind of like um, uh, soft um, microfiber bag that you can also use for cleaning your lens if you want to, which is pretty nice, nice to have. Uh, and as you can see, the main feature here is the, the diffuser that is very soft so you can just fold it around just throw it in your in your bag in your camera bag and bag and take it to any event or place where you want to actually use it so as a comparison i'm going to show you what i used to use before i bought this mag mod diffuser kit this is what i used to use and you can find one of these uh, pieces of tupperware pretty pretty cheaply online on amazon or ebay um, and it's worked okay for me in the past. It's just all right. Um, so what you do is that you put in your speed light right here. You attach it. You're tightening it up with the Velcro included, and you're ready to shoot. Uh, it works okay, but there are some problems with it. First of all, this is hard. So if you compare it to the Mag Mod, you can just fold it around and it goes back to its original shape. Uh, this one doesn't. So it takes a lot of space in your bag. And another problem is that the top right here, I don't know if you can see it there, but it's starting to yellow a little bit. Uh, it used to be the same color as this part right here, uh, but uh, it's lost a little bit of that um, uh, clear color. And I'm not sure if that was gonna affect my, my pictures, so I just decided to go, go ahead and buy one online. Uh, and uh, you can buy the Again, the MagMod kit for about a hundred dollars on on Amazon, which is a little bit a little bit pricey, uh, pricey, but uh, I think it is worth it anyways. Uh, so I'll show you how it works. So again, you get your three items. Uh, you get the, and I actually haven't used uh, this grid yet, so I can't really say too much about it. But it's just nice to have. So all, all you really need is the uh, the grip and the, um, the diffuser. So what you do is that you uh, use your speed light and it can be used for any kind of uh, speed lights out there. I am using it on my TT560 uh, from Newer and uh, this, uh, this is the uh, name of the brand right here. I'll put a link here in the description in case you want to pick one of these ones up. Great, great speed lights. I always use this ones. Um, and um, you just put in the, gri the grip in the top of it. So a lot of people are in the in YouTube are saying that it's kind of hard to put in and yes it is hard to put in but the uh, advantage is that once you have it in you don't have to take it out you can just keep it in there and what you do is just uh, and I, I figure that it has this holders right here I don't know if you can see them there this openings in this in in both sides that will help you put the, uh, the grip in the top of the uh, of your flash. So what you do is you grab it from here and you pull it really hard. And it may take a few tries. And then just push it in. So this rubber or this um, elastic band, it's really tight. <laughs> it, it will stay there. 
and there's magnets in here and, and the magnets are also very very strong so there it is once you have it in there it can just stay there and you can just it doesn't take that much additional space in your speed light so you can just keep it like that and the uh, next step just grab your diffuser and it uh, pops right in and you're ready to shoot with your speed light uh, I did notice that there is a very big openness here and obviously this is designed for uh, circular speed lights or the, the, the ones that are that take a lot more uh, that are a little bit bigger they take more space uh, but they work just fine in this one as long as you're shooting uh, forward on this uh, they will work just fine uh, so that that's how it works and if, if you wanted to use the grid again I haven't used this before just uh, put it in between the two of them like that so pretty handy very easy to use uh, that's uh, the main feature about this modifier and it's also much much lighter than using this big uh, piece of Tupperware and it's also much more secure because uh, I found out that this velcro wasn't work working very well uh, on, on this on my old one uh, this is a much much superior product so my overall review of the MagMod Starter Flash Kit 2, it is actually very, very positive. I have used this many times before and I've been very happy with the results. Main thing is that it works. Uh, it does diffuse the light pretty uh, fairly evenly on the, in, the, in your pictures. Uh, is it perfect? No, uh, you know, you are still going to have uh, a little bit of a brighter image, I think, in the center of the picture if you use this. Um, as an on-camera flash and I've only used this as an on-camera flash I haven't used it as an off-camera yet uh, with that option uh, maybe in the future I will and I will update my review but uh, it is still a really really good option it still diffuses the, the light really really well uh, even as an on-camera flash I'm gonna include some sample pictures uh, that I've, uh, I've taken before at the end of the video so you can take a look at some of my results using this uh, MagMod starter flash kit. And uh, like I said before, I have not used the, this at all with the grid yet. Maybe in the future I will, but as for now, all my results were just using this straight up flash with the MagMod uh, and uh, with the on-camera flash. So I just attached this to, a, to the top of my camera and that's it. So overall, very recommended. Uh, great option in case you are uh, looking for an, a good diffuser that will fit in your camera bag pretty easily. Like I said, you can just take it off like that, fold it, whatever you want, and just put it in, in a corner of your bag. So it's a great option, great design, and so I'm very happy with it. So I give it a thumbs up. I'll put a link here in the description. It is going to be an Amazon affiliate link, so it will support the channel in case you buy it uh, at, no at no additional cost to you. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.